All right. Well, I think now we're more or less kind of where we were before. I know that I'd seen more that last time, but really the hell with it. <laughs> I missed something over here, which I should have done when I was out there at the garden. And I haven't done anything on the second floor yet, but whatever. I probably missed out on some gold and stuff, but who cares? Who cares? I just want to get this over with. This is kind of annoying. Ew. Hey, look, he's also got kind of a pagan style table. Are these more barracks? Oh, these are the servants' quarters. This is the barracks. See, that seems backwards to me. These, this looks nice enough to be the barracks. And that back there, I would have thought would be the servants' quarters because it's just so barren. And apparently the servants have money, but the soldiers don't. That seems weird. I mean, the servants, you'd think, wouldn't maybe be getting paid that much. But, uh, I don't know why there's a light in here. And it switched just to that light. What was the point in that? And yeah, that stupid thing just always stares this direction and never turns away. So you can't really get out that door. You have to come through this way. You can't go in that door either. Ooh. This is kind of a nice kitchen. Oh. I'm just going to have to pause and listen. Yeah, exactly. Before saving. See, because how would I have known that someone was within earshot of that? That's bullshit. Such crap. It's stupid. Friggin' switch backwards. Because I had to frob it twice to get it to move, so. That's a boo boo. How would you really do this mission if you didn't know about Creep Crouch Crawl? I mean, as a kid, I never knew about Creep, creep Crouch Crawl. And I think that I, as a kid, I would either skip past this mission or just play it on normal and kind of buzz through the main parts where you had to be. And didn't really go into this stuff. Hey, look, the, these uh, stone and metal ovens have wood on the inside of the doors. That's freaking dumb. Makes no sense. Hey, look, the textures are misaligned there. Hey, look, I'm a little pissed off and kind of tired and stuff, so. Viewer beware. <sighs> oh, look, more mistakes on the floor over there. At that corner. I guess I'm going for the spice over here. I guess I do have some moss arrows. As I, as I was saying, though, a long time ago, um, overall, this mission looks fairly nice, aside from a little hint of... What's that? Shit. There's never really anything. <laughs> oh, you ass. Okay, good, you didn't see me. It's freaking lucky. Whatever. Anyway, I mean, overall, I mean, there's got some nice detail here, although it's a little short on objects. Like, it could use a little more stuff filling up all the rooms. Oh, shit. Oh, phew. Uh, yeah, good. Okay. It's backwards. So that's up. It's a reversal of the other one. It's weird. Well, at least I made it this far the kitchen that's the ultimate ultimate location apparently what well, are you trying to nap while you're doing your patrol at the same time that makes sense shit but yeah I mean how the hell would you know when someone's caught you until unless you just pause and wait I mean fair enough I guess you should just pause and wait and it's that simple but god god damn it that really pulls a buggering trick on you. What's that? I was already in there, wasn't I? Yep. That's where this twit goes in and out. Ah, uh, storage. Yes. I'm sure Gervasius has lots this of things. This is different storage. I didn't see the other storage. At least not until it's too. I'll probably get to it again later, maybe. 
Anything on here? Yep, there sure is. A forced ghost mission like this, though, is dumb. Forced ghosting sucks. What? Oh, I must just hit my scroll wheel or something, because... I was like, what, did I, pick a, did I take a lockpick out of there or something? <laughs> no, probably not. Probably not so. Ah, right. So, actually, I'll, I think we am going to come up to the second floor here. And see if I can come down the other side, and then I'll come back. Still do really like the look of this place. These upstairs is really, really cool. I'm getting more gold than I expected to, considering I was... I was anticipating just kind of saying the hell with it and just running through here to get back to where I was before, but seems I'm doing a little bit better than anticipated. Oh, shit. I turned all these off, though. At least on this other side. I'm not sure if that's supposed to be possible, but we made it work. Screw it over. <sighs> so tedious. I guess I knew what what was coming, but it doesn't make it much better. Shouldn't I be on the second floor here? Nah, whatever. That guy doesn't hear me. Oh. Nah. <laughs> Okay, let's try it over here instead, shall we? Oh, god damn it. I guess it's because we're on the second floor now, so... That's why there's suddenly working stuff everywhere. And by stuff, I mean the cameras. I do kind of like the second floor. How it's kind of, uh... Got all those balconies and stuff. That's neat. Um, where was I trying to get to? Try and get to over here. Am I actually though? I think I just went over here and I'm like around here or something. I don't even know. Okay. I don't even know. Uh 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 uh. Uh Hopefully no one heard that. Okay for the moment. I hope. I seem to be okay anyway, so. Please, game, don't not screw me over. That would be very, very cruel of you. Great, now I'm on the complete wrong side. Because I did want to kind of check out what was what else is over there. And I was probably at the end anyway, or close enough. So, the hell with it. We'll see more of it in the next stupid mission. I'm just saying that because I'm tired. <laughs> Don't take it too personally. Just kind of a pointless mission, that's all. Pointless two missions. I didn't save, did I? Frick! Ah. Come on, squeeze around here. There we go. Someone coming? Thought I heard someone. And if, if I lose again because I quick saved at the wrong point, I'm just going to be so pissed. Suck that it happened even the one time. Well, like I said, you never know, and that's the kind of dickish part of this mission. Well, one of them. There are many kind of dickish parts of this mission. I was kind of thinking this was like something that I think is actually in the third game. Where you have some, like, guards who are playing cards or something. Where am I? Oh. Huh? How did I get back? Oh, whatever. <laughs> whatever. Am I going to even have a... Am I even going to be able to get through here? Or maybe. Uh-huh. Well, not right now, anyway. Let's do the waiting game. Yay, the waiting game. Everyone's favorite part. Yay. You know, for whatever anyone says of Dishonored, it did sure speed up the whole sneaking stuff 
with allowing you to zip from one place to another. What? I was just over there. Okay, I guess that's just a fail on the part of the auto mapping. Whoops. Okay. I guess I have to go all the way around again. Unless I just find this point where I can go up to the next floor, I'll just do that. I don't remember where, though. Unless I already am. Wait, I already am on the second floor. Duh. One smart. Ooh, what? What this? Ooh, what this? More secret passengers. I think that might be the one. Z one, if you will. Oh no! I'm performing on stage. Yay! Gary is such a great performer. Oh, that doesn't count as a secret. Damn it! If only. How close am I to finding all seven secrets? Oh my god. Wait a second. Is that a secret over there? Over there? Does that... No, I guess not. It kind of looked like it was to me there. At least briefly. Oh. Hopefully that didn't catch everyone's attention. You never know. I'm not sure if Creep Crouch Crawl was really intended to work this way. I mean, there should have been some s relatively simple means of uh, sneaking. And Creep Crouch Crawl isn't all that simple. You know, it requires you to constantly... Uh, constantly listen and kind of tap and hold and tap and hold. And it's really slow and tedious. What is the deal with all these little places like this? Hello? Anyone there? Trying to get your purse. Are we caught? Have we been hoodwinkled, so to speak? I don't know what that means. Hoodwinked? Conservatory? I guess that's where we were. Hmm. I guess we're going there again because... Actually, let's go down through here. What's the deal with that? I'm not sure if that's supposed to be that way. Little block sticking out of the wall there. I right, don't seem right. I do kind of like how you have to kind of crouch and duck around stuff in here. It's kind of neat. I approve. Yeah, I'm pretty sure that's where we're, we're headed, so beware. It freaked me out as a kid. Probably won't freak me out anymore so much, but I don't know. I'd say it's one of the spookiest things in even both the games, so prepare yourself. Oh, is that all the... good? Kind of just out of nowhere, but... what? Oh, okay. Whatever. Hey, we actually have a Gervasius tapestry. Which we just chopped. Yay! Narrating the events as they happen. Best commentary ever. Okay, good. Those assholes are out. Whoops. Oh, boy. Okay. <clears throat> I'm gonna get that purse, brah. Just so you're aware. I'm gonna... Whoa! Hey, stop. Shit. I'm gonna shit. Hey, stop! Oh shit! Huh? What? Let's come this way. This isn't right. Mm. Fuck! Huh? Huh? Are we co are we good? We get through this. Why does it give me all this crap? Well, I, I guess it's because if we're playing at a lower difficulty, you'd have the ability to knock... No, actually, I think that this is forced ghosting no matter what your difficulty is. Well, that's the case, then why give us healing potions or, or the option to buy weapons or anything? 
I mean, if you can't ever use them, what's the freaking point? Is he gone? If not, I'll just wait over here. At least we haven't lost yet. I hesitate to save, though, because... We could just up and lose in any second, and all of a sudden he increases his alert or something, so... Ah, uh, let me do this. Hard save. It's a good, hard save. Just what the doctor ordered. Okay, well, let's see what's up and around here. So I would like to explore a little more since I need some more secrets. And those are important for our winitude. Our winage. Was I already in here? I think I was. Not sure if I checked all of these, though. Okay, came in through there. And yeah, I guess I did. Also, those... All those light switches are still broken, and uh, those chests kind of have some settings a bit screwed up because I thought I heard something. Because those chests are supposed to open immediately as soon as you click on them, but I had to click on them two times because the joint settings on their on their lids are reversed, so. It, they're already closed, but then when you use them, you close them, and then you op then you have to click them again to open them. So it makes no sense. Also, what the hell? You, this thing is a little too close to the wall. Pretty sure you don't want to have wallpaper right inside of your fireplace. I do kind of like how this is a bit at an angle, but there's not much point to it aside from that coin. Whatever. Okay, I'm going to risk a quick save, because at this point, I'm pretty sure that that guy's not going to alert to us anymore. You mean you lost a whole stack of books? No, the M stacks. It's a section of bookcases. They're just called stacks. I don't believe even you could lose a whole bookcase. I tell you the place is haunted. One minute, I was on my way to Father Lord's letters. Then I heard this terrible sound. And when I turned around, the M stacks were gone. I'll say you got turned around all right. You don't understand. I dropped the letters on the floor and they were gone too. I looked everywhere. I don't know what you expect me to do about it. I'm a guard, not an exorcist. Some help you are. Hmm. I don't think I've ever, ever heard that conversation before, ever. Huh. Interesting. Hello? Any valuables? Does this guy have a mustache? I'm just curious. He does. Interesting. Okay. Oh, what? What was that? Ah, oh, damn it! Are you four four rizzles? Well, at least he's not directly in my way. But god damn it! Ah. <sighs> Thought he was on like a patrol route or something. Apparently, it had to do with this conversation. I'm sure, this guy's gonna see me. Not again. That won't be enough. Oh, he, he is facing the right way. Cool. Got lucky there. Okay, now this is the one I think that has the cuckoo missing. Yep. No, no, no. Wrong. There we are. Ah, and that's the stairs up to the third floor. Huh. This is a scary thing of which I referred. Huh. You know what? I really... I guess it doesn't count seven secrets. Maybe there'll be a secret in here that'll do the trick. I really, really thought that you had to come through th the library. I really did. Every time I've played this game, this mission in the past, every time I've had to come through the li I've always come through the library. Whoa! Terrible Shit. Secrets. Terrible secrets. Yeah. 
I mean, I guess maybe it isn't as scary anymore. Except for being startled by that. Because, I mean, I know what happens and stuff. But, as a kid, this freaked me the hell out. I mean, I swear to God. I was terrified by this. There goes the only apparition in this game. As far as I recall. Awesome sound design, though. It's just really creepy. Even though, all things considered... Even though it's kind of dark, this this library doesn't look too foreboding. I mean, look, it's got warm colors. It's got uh, really cool attention to detail. I mean, look, all the all these are lettered and everything. That's that's neat. But I mean, yeah, it, it's just it's just weird because even though this looks kind of warm, at least in my mind as a kid, this was freaking terrifying. Love the design of this library, though. It's so detailed. It's amazing. Yes, this is at the end of that one hallway I was thinking of. So that's all the way I've always come in here. I never come. I do that. I've never come from the other direction. So it's interesting. This is why I was checking out if that guy had a mustache or not, because this guy does. This guy's invincible, by the way. At least at the moment. Yeah, this is exactly like that other guy. Hmm. And he will kind of bugger you up. He's completely invulnerable for the time being. As far as I know, anyway. Good. Yeah, I don't have any holy water, so maybe if I had holy water, I could splash it near him and it'd kill him, but I don't, so I can't. So. Hey, look, there's a secret over there. Hmm. Well, we'll get to that in a bit. Wanna go around and check out all these ghostly sounds first. Okay. I made a fan mission that I mentioned before. Um, out of part of Life of the Party. And I made a library in it, and it was heavily inspired by this part of this mission here. Because it just looks so cool. I love the look of this. This is like the only thing in this mission that I think is really awesome. I'm not sure if it is in the second one though. You know what? I think maybe it is. But if you do it in this mission, then it's not in the second mission. Or something. Yeah, now that I think about it, I'm pretty sure this is that thing. As mentioned here, this optional thing. That if we do it here, it won't be in this next one. I think. Be mistaken, but I'm pretty sure. Anyway, there was. Yeah, here we go. Giles, or Giles. Uh huh. So, this Lorna is cheating on her husband Ashton with this guy, Giles, or Giles. Or. At least I thought that that was the case. You know, maybe it's the other way around. Or maybe they're not married at all. No, she's not married to anyone yet. I don't know. Maybe I'm jumping ahead of what I recall being the case with this. I just kind of skim read. I don't know. I, I assume she's talking about his manhood. I don't know how long it is, lady. You tell me. I, in fact, don't. I don't even want to know. Okay, so Giles. This is someone else away from Gervasius, alright. Uh... See, yeah, so she wanted to be married to Giles, or Giles, I'll just call him Giles, but Ashton's losing her, so either he was married to her at first. Or something. I don't follow exactly. It'll probably become more clear as we read more. Nobody knows. Nobody sees. Stop popping out and freaking me out, lady. God damn. Just trying to read a freaking book here. Oh, <laughs> I got a little startled there because I had my cat scratching at the door. I'm like, oh my god! 
Uh, okay. Okay, yeah. So, actually, Giles was in, was the head librarian, huh? And Lorna's husband, Ashton, is just his assistant? Huh. Uh, okay. Yeah, so she's, like, cheating on her husband and wants to run away with him. But it's okay because he's a wife-beating jerk, so... Don't feel bad for for their uh, their affair, cause it's all cool. But whoa, my fucking god! Why well, I'm reading books if you wouldn't give me a goddamn heart attack by bumping up in my freaking face? Jesus Christ! Whew. I'm not like scared, scared, but I mean, <laughs> if an AI pops up in your face, you're gonna be a little startled there. Don't turn this way. Okay, thank you. Didn't you used to walk downstairs? Why are you not doing that now? Yeah, so the sound effects are near the books. So let's find the next sound effects. That's what we need to read next. Around here. No. Uh. Damn it. Too bright over here. Uh, what evs, dude? Just what evs? No, that's not. I don't want to have him on my ass this whole time. Whoop! Better get back. There we go. Now we can slip on past this mustachio little menace. Let's see. Where is that sound? Ooh, yummies, gold. Whoop. That was close. I thought there was another one around here somewhere. Maybe it doesn't spawn till later. Till, till later. Maybe we've read all the books now. Maybe. Okay, let's go on and check out that secret we saw. Oh, that's what it is. is. Okay. Either someone's hiding the evidence, or these guys got lost in ten feet of passage. Secrets in libraries are always freaking awesome. <laughs> it's just so cool. So, apparently... Uh, actually, I don't think we know what happens yet. I think now we're able to find out. What? Okay. Pretty sure... What? Hmm. There's another readable somewhere. Come on, go past. Thank you. Let's keep our ears open. It's tough because the sound effect is similar to the ghost, which is obviously kind of the point. So you don't know if it's. Oh my. F Yeah, yeah, whatever. Jesus Christ. I'm trying to help you here. You're trying to give me a goddamn heart attack. Uh, uh, uh. Okay, I think we're good. So what did I miss? Here? Oh. Okay. Apparently these are letters, even though they're in books. Maybe the letter is, like, inside the book. Like between the pages or something. Oh yeah, I guess that's what's being indicated here. It's like a little note inside the, the book. I get it now. Hmm. Yeah, okay, yeah. So she'll divorce him, divorce Ashton, and run away with Giles. Giles. I just can't decide how to pronounce that. Okay, now I think there's one more readable now. I believe it's on the third floor. So bad at this. Did the ghost disappear? I think he did. Okay, so yeah, this is here now. Hmm. 
Okay. Okay. So, he killed... So, Ashton her, found out about it, killed his wife and her lover, the head librarian, and stuffed them in the wall. And apparently this must have been fairly recently, because otherwise you'd think that someone would have noticed the stink of dead bodies rotting inside the walls, but... I don't know. Makes it seem like it's been a long time ago. So here's my question, though. Okay, so we've got the ghost of the woman, Lorna, who's kind of popping up in our face and startling us. And then who's the jerk who's going around trying to attack us? That must be... That, that must have been Giles. Ash, you are a bastard. That, that must have been Gu Giles who was patrolling here, right? But, uh, it's a little weird in my mind anyway, because why would Giles be, like, menacing and after us? Is he just, just wanting revenge for he and his lover being killed? I don't, I don't completely understand. It's just kind of weird. Um, also, it, it's kind of weird that that one AI we heard talking about this place happened to have a mustache just like Giles. So, it makes it seem like that's either... Uh, maybe that was Ashton, but I don't think it's supposed to be Ashton because this mentions that Ashton left. Unless that was just recently. So maybe that was Ashton down there and he had only just put that note there or something. I don't know. I don't know exactly how it's supposed to be. Also, it's kind of weird that Garrett is like, Ash, you are a bastard. I mean, of all the things he's seen, or all the... Because this isn't the first time we've seen like a weird thing like this in the game. So of all the things he's seen, this is the one where he bothers to comment. This one in particular, you know, he really cares about these guys, his little affair, and a jealous husband. So, it's kind of strange. So, yeah, the ghost is gone now, apparently. The apparition, rather. Yeah, so I guess if we hadn't done that in this mission, we would have done the next one. Which just means that this thing is even that much more pointless because we could have already done it in the previous mission. And this is that side thing. That means we have more secrets you have to find. God damn it. Okay. Let's see. Terracius. Uh, find management city. Blah, blah, blah. Ancient masks and cultivator artifact. What is a cultivator? Isn't that like a agricultural device? If thou. Uh, I think this will be another page, but there isn't. Whoops. Looks like I'll be able to get one of those cultivators when I come back. Unless maybe that's intended. Maybe it's intentional that you're not able to read the next page. Like it's only one page out of many. Yeah, okay, this is the M. So, so yeah, that, that guy we heard talking down there, he said he came up to the M section and he was putting something there and it disappeared. So, either he was putting both letters there, both he was filing away that note from Gervasius to Karis. I don't know why that'd be in the M. Maybe it's M under Mechanist, maybe. So, uh, yeah, he was putting out there and then it disappeared. And maybe also his resignations. Maybe, so maybe that was Ashton. I don't know. If you know, leave a comment. Let me know. Because I'd like to know, but I just don't know. So, let me know. You know? I was already in here, wasn't I? Or did I not do that after saving? Okay. This gets me up to the third floor. Except for I don't think I'm allowed to be up here. This is when the game is supposed to end. It's supposed to. Because, yeah, it's supposed to be the end of it now because I'm up on the third floor. So I wonder how much further I can go now since I have, I have, a, I have an objective that's still not completed. So I wonder, I wonder how much further I can get in this. Well, I can obviously go in there. So a fair bit further, apparently. Nope, not a... Unless the placement of this AI here guarantees that I can't sneak past. Possible. Possible. No. 
I could definitely get past him. Do I even have to get out? Yeah, I do have to get out. Okay. So I'm just trying to find more secrets, which just sucks. It is sucks. I shouldn't be able to be here until the next mission. Which just makes it all the more pointless that I'm here right now and not in the next mission alone. Cats are crying to get out, but I'm hopefully I'm hoping that I can just get this thing done with. Okay, so I could come through here, and that's intended. So the developers are aware that I can come up here without any cheating or trickery. Ooh. Show yourself. No. Be cool. Be cool. Okay. And oh, these are worth nothing. What? Well, this is the mask I'm going to come for tomorrow. What the hell is this crap? Oh, this is also a trap. When we come t tomorrow, this floor here, it's a trap. But I guess it's not yet. I better save, do a hard save, just in case I screw something up. I don't have to restart again. Uh, 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 uh. Okay. That noise? Damn it. Uh. Wait a second, I think that there's also a way up and out through here. At least there is in the next mission, I'm pretty sure. Yep, there is here too. Well, we had the damn precursor mask, so why the hell do we have to come back for it next time, huh? Unless that's the wrong kind of mask. I mean, I, I know, I guess, I guess it is the wrong kind of mask, because it doesn't look like a servant mask. Which, by the way, if we need a servant mask so damn much, why don't we just take a mask off of a servant, huh? Why do we have to get one from Gervasius here? Oh, look, hey, there's a servant mask. What? This is ridiculous. My God. All this crap. It's, what a mess. Jesus Christ. I'm just going to keep this going. Uh, God damn it. Cat. Fine. I'll be back. I'm going to let the cat out. But I'm, I'm now I'm actually genuinely curious. <laughs> I want to see how much I can actually finish in this mission.